North Dakota first. Welcome back. A study shows 30% of patients with higher than normal blood pressure readings experience white coat hypertension. It's a phenomenon where your blood pressure spikes in a clinical setting. Mandy, Mandy Gaither tells us why it's dangerous and what you need to know. And this today is in today's Your Health First. When your blood pressure at home is noticeably lower than it is at your doctor's office, you may be experiencing white coat hypertension, widely believed to be caused by anxiety. If your blood pressure is falsely elevated, then you may be prescribed medicines that you're not supposed to be on if that is not your true blood pressure. Dr. Barbara Joy Jones of Atlanta's Northside Hospital Gwinnett says there are simple things patients can do to make sure blood pressure levels are accurate. A proper blood pressure would be you not talking and just relaxing. You want your feet shoulder width and flat on the ground and you're seated. I want you to have your arm shoulder width um, basically at the level of the heart and resting. And be aware of what can drive your blood pressure upward. Joan says having a full bladder can raise your level by 10 to 15 points. Experiencing stress like being late or getting stuck in traffic before your appointment can also raise your level. It's unclear how much. The cuff should also fit easily over the patient's arm and should be placed on bare skin. Joan says putting the cuff over clothing can add as much as 50 points to the reading. I'm Mandy Gaither. If you have white coat hypertension, experts suggest asking your doctor about wearing a blood pressure monitor for 24 hours to help determine if your high blood pressure only happens at the doctor's office or if it's actually a persistent condition that needs to be treated. Well, stay tuned. Coming up next, a cause you won't want to miss.